What's your name? Yummy Fox. Professional twerker. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Adam was from Ham on Everything. We took a brunch one Sunday morning. She happened to be there. And then somebody mentioned like, oh, you know how they have hype man? Why don't you have a hype girl? And then we kind of moved on from hype girl to like twerking for her. And just hanging out with her and having fun on stage. No. Uh, what's your name? Debbie, Lil Debbie. So you got this little professional twerker with you. Yes, my professional twerker, <laughs> Remy Fox. She's amazing. I don't know, I'd say like I came in the game with Remy. We've been like fucking with shit for like a year now. She's amazing. She's probably like one of the funniest bitches I know. <laughs> she's pretty funny. That's really why I have her here, not to twerk, because she's fucking hella funny. She's alright. <laughs> I'm not gonna like keep giving her compliments and shit. So you got suspended from Twitter be for being like all the way out there like how you are. Like they don't get that it's a joke, like it's the internet people troll. I got my Twitter deleted or suspended when they got deleted because of some hater that actually thought I was 13. Oh wow. Like, no, I'm not really 13. No, I'm not going to tell you my age, no. It, certain people take it way too personal and go to the extreme. Here's the thing, I'm the voice of those girls that wish they could say those things. Like, they wish they can shout out their inner sluttiness out in the world, but they can't just because of who they are. Or they're scared that their friends are gonna think. And I honestly don't care, like, who thinks badly about me. Linger, there's, there can be different types of linger. Thought linger and then just like, me Like, how I linger. <laughs> Me lingering is going out to a club and just literally lingering people. Like I linger my way into like VIP, drink the bottles, make friends, you know, and then linger in a club the next day. Yeah. Here's the thing, I'm not from LA. I'm from Orange County. Let's keep this separate. I'm not from LA, Orange County. I love LA. That's where I started. I would just take the bus, make my mom take me, hitchhike, jump in a taxi and jump out and not pay, beg people to take me to LA, like, and just party it. In East LA, in Compton, in Skid Row, like everywhere, hang the DJs, blow up LA. That's how I started and I mean, I thank LA for that. Because Orange County doesn't have that scene and it will never have that scene. You don't have to say a name necessarily, oh. but you can if you want. Uh, there's too many. So, show with my friend Brittany and we were fucked up. I mixed my alcohol, I, somebody gave me a pill, Drake was there. I bump into Drake. I'm so nervous, I throw up. Luckily he was really nice and he was like, oh it's okay, blah blah blah. And I was like, ah. and I ran away and I cried. We were at the Adidas show and I managed to linger my way with a music people so I was backstage. Either Snoop Dogg or his people noticed me and my friend and all I felt was a big grab. It's like, yo, come to this trailer. Snoop Dogg wants to meet you. I was like, oh, okay. They checked our IDs, you know, checked our bags, whatever. We go in. He's smoking a mountain, like a good weed. Dr. Dre was there, but nobody thinks so. Like, I'm convinced he was there. And he made me twerk for him for 20 minutes, and it was really hard. <laughs> I was like, are we done? <laughs> but you know what? I loved it. It was, it was new. I, when I died, this was into my grandchildren. <laughs> Who? 
and so this bitch came in my life so you can thank her for that cool yeah thank you all right